Preparation For this sign, we'll use a 15-pound density blank sheet of sign foam. As we just discussed, pick the right density for the job. The first step of preparation is to ensure the primer has a smooth surface to adhere to. Over the course of the job, you'll use both a coarse 120 grit and a fine 400 grit piece of sandpaper. For this step, however, we'll use the fine 400 grit sandpaper. The objective here is to just knock off the peaks of the cells, creating more surface area. Using a coarser grit will expose the underlying cells and create an uneven surface. The size of the paper you use depends on the size of the job. For small jobs, use a small piece of sandpaper. For larger jobs, use a sanding block, such as this one made from a piece of sign foam. Sign foam's smooth edges make it an ideal choice for this tool. Circular patterns are efficient and do a good job of even coverage, but back and forth or up and down patterns are an option as well. Sanding sign foam is fast. A whole four foot by eight foot sheet should only take about five minutes or so. What little dust there is with sign foam can be removed with a brush or with a vacuum with a brush attachment.